Hi everyone, it's Lydia Nekozawa, the universe's favorite YouTuber, and I am here with Kenny! What's up? And today we're going to be reacting to a trailer. What are we reacting to, Kenny? Yeah, we're going to be taking a look at Resident Evil 8 for the PlayStation 5. Ooh. Now, this trailer just debuted earlier today at the PS5. It uh, wasn't the reveal event, but it was like the update event where they dropped the price, the release date, and all that type stuff. So anyways, this game is basically a successor to Resident Evil 7, starring, I believe the character's name was Ethan? and his girlfriend Mia, who like turned into this evil demon mm. and chopped your hand off, I think, ah. at one point, and some other crazy crap. But anyways, this is the sequel. Anyways, let's just jump into it, and we'll see uh, what they got to offer. All right. RE Engine. That looks almost similar to the Kojima Productions logo for a second. A little bit. They all do, though. OK. All clear. Oh, move! Oh boy. Chris? Chris? What, what the, the hell? hell? Take Chris. him away. Chris Redfield. Chris Redfield? He's evil now? I don't know. Or it's not the real Chris. Capcom. I forget that Capcom makes this. I know, right? I always think like Street Fighter when I think of Capcom. Ah! In life and in death, we give glory. The bell tolls for us all. Ugh. They're coming again. Uh oh. <laughs> ah! oh, she's creepy. Hey! 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 What was that? He said Mia. Quit being so paranoid. Oh, that's his wife. Mm. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, okay. who was hard at work. Uh -huh. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. Ooh. That's him. The bush is empty. Casting a shadow, walking through the forest. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free of mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Oh boy. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine, under branch. Uh-oh. What are you and doing, kid? The forest deep. No! Ew, what was that? A fetus? Oh, they're like cultists! Zombies oh, with right. weapons? What? That makes no sense! What? What? It's just a local tale. What are you doing living uh, in some old rinky dink village? Uh, Mia, come on! So it's like a sketchy... Ah! Ah! Evil. Smoking is bad. If it's just looking, window shop away. Oh, he's a, he's a merchant? Ah! Got ah! some rare things on sale, stranger. A jingle of coin will change your offer. <laughs> All footage captured on PS5. Excellent, excellent That's news. That's what you want to hear. Yes. So what did you think of Resident Evil 8? Spooky as hell. I don't like yep. Resident Evil games, but I appreciate that they are very well made and they have a really, really great storyline. But as for me, jump scares are not my forte. I don't know. I'm just not good at them. I'm not good. I get too scared. And also I have very bad reaction time. So I like watching other people play Resident Evil. But for me playing it myself, I am not a good gamer that way. I am more of a puzzler, but I do really like the Resident Evil series. I think it's super well done. Yeah. What do you yeah. think, Ken? No, I'm looking forward to this one. I enjoyed Seven a lot. It kind of brought the series back to horror after, uh, you know, five and Resident Evil Five and Six were really goofy, and then which ones were those? Those. That's the one where you're like fighting these weird zombies that uh, were in Africa, and then the one after that is like three games in one. And then seven is when you get back to uh, it's it's the first person one that was also VR. 
capable. Oh. I wonder if this one will be available to play on the PlayStation VR. Oh, that's something interesting to look into. I'm mm. not quite sure about that, but uh, the game looks good regardless. Yeah. Seven was fantastic. I never played the expansion, uh, the DLC, but I did play the original and it was really good. And I'm sure this is going to be uh, along the same lines. At least I would hope so, mm. but I mean, there's no guarantee, right? Because if you think about Final Fantasy, or not Final, why did I say Final Fantasy? If you think about Resident Evil 2 remake, it was absolutely glorious. But then Resident Evil 3, which should have been just as great, was very mediocre. Mm. So to say that just because 7 was great, 8 is going to be great is is not like a guarantee, right? Mm -hmm. It's hard to say, but only time's going to really tell. There's some interesting stuff here, like zombies. Uh, zombies with weapons, by the looks of it? Or what are these they guys? They got smarted? I don't know what they are. Then there's yeah, a guy yeah. with a, an eye patch. Was there a werewolf earlier in the trailer? I'm not sure. Um, this must be Mia. Yeah. I assume that's his wife. Uh, and something probably happens to her. To her. Mm -hmm. um, I like yeah. that um, that kind of cinematic storytelling thing. It looks very like um, Tim Burton kind of vibe. It does look Tim Burton-ish, doesn't yeah, it? This part right, here like, where she's talking about like the child who ran into the forest. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm so, getting, I'm getting um, some Tim Burton vibes. Which yeah, I love Tim very Burton. creepy. But very, yes, Tim Burton-ish. Mm, mm, mm. Anyways, I think that's really all there is to say for the time being. Now, actually, I guess we could jump very quickly into Chris Redfield here. This is his silhouette standing right oh, here. Yeah. And you can see, obviously, whatever they're driving is here shining mm. a light in. Ethan's on the floor here. And we only know that because we watched the other trailer previously mm, mm. where you got it from a different perspective of Ethan on the floor looking up at Chris. Mm, and this is mm. the same trailer from a different angle. Oh. Now, uh... Vantage point. Yeah. Chris shoots someone else and then he yells at Ethan. Now, whether he shoots Mia or he just shoots someone else, mm. I don't know. Mm. But I'm sure we'll find out as the game drops in 2021. Ah! Anyways, I think that's really all there is to say for the time being, Lydia. Okay. All right, everybody. What did you think of this new trailer for Resident Evil Village? Were you spooked out by it? Do you think it's going to be just as good as 7? Let us know in the comments below. If you like what you see, hit that subscribe button. Give us a like and a share. Likes are very important for our channel. It's because of tiny channel exposure, and we need your help to defeat umbrella corp so like our stuff if you want to follow us on twitter our handle is you are dorkalicious we also stream live weekly on twitch our handle is super underscore dorkalicious and don't forget to join the discord link is in the description okay guys it's been lydia nekozawa the universe's favorite oh, youtuber God. and yeah i'm KG. and it's been fun dorking out with you bye bye, bye. Hey guys, this is Lydia. If you like what you see, hit that like button as it helps our channel gain exposure. Also consider smashing subscribe. If you like our content, it would really mean a lot and helps our channel grow. If you want to interact with us, leave a comment down below or follow us on Twitch at super underscore dorkalicious. We'll see you next time.